This is another great shot from uh, photojournalist Chris Gay. So obviously we see the sun coming up as we look at the uh, Freedom Tower, 1776, right there. But we're waiting because things are going to change dramatically. Mostly clear in 70, wind out of the south-southwest at 8 miles an hour. Here's what's going on right now. Nothing. But into parts of the Hudson Valley, this is indicative of what we anticipate this afternoon. I don't know where you get a little shower, brief heavy rain and then you wait and wait and wait. What are we waiting for? We're waiting for the front. The front is just now basically clearing Ontario and then it winds its way down into parts of the Ohio Valley. But there's energy in the atmosphere before the front gets here. So here's the concern. Skipping ahead to seven o'clock this morning, fine out the door. But as early as one o'clock, look at that. Little isolated thunderstorm and you're nowhere near the front. So as early as lunchtime, parts of the area sees a shower or a storm, but it's that four to six o'clock period. That's when you're really gonna see things get busy. And again, the roadways are getting busy. Watch what happens. See how that just lights up. That's the concern, these isolated severe storms. One more impulse overnight and then, oh, get ready. Gonna be so nice this weekend with less humidity and really nice numbers for Saturday, for Sunday, Father's Day, and then Monday, ooh, the fulcrum, as we see the heat take over. I mean, here comes the summer, and it is gonna feel like it. first heat wave of the season is gonna be next week. Kinda early to have our first heat wave of the season? No, 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 no. We're, in fact, we are late. We're late for everything. Late for first 90, late for, it's been very quiet. We, in New York, yep have to be thankful we've had great weather. Yeah, not late for dinner though, ever. <laughs> ever. <laughs>